Alright guys, so this is my fish fountain that I made out of a 35 liter tub from Home Depot. I have two LED lights above it there for some extra light. I'll turn those on in a second. And um, I made the whole fountain part out of great stuff foam. As you can see, there's the waterfall that comes down here. Now underneath it, right there, I left a hole for the uh, intake of the filter to suck in any debris or waste from the fish. Um, any food flakes that sink to the bottom will get sucked into there and cleaned. And then the clean water is expelled from the falls. I got one live plant here. Every, uh, every other plant here is fake. I'll probably be adding some more. And yeah, so what I did was I made the frame out of styrofoam and then I spray foamed it all around it to make sure it's a waterproof seal. And um, then I got amazing goop plumbing adhesive and I, well, I painted it first. Then I put the adhesive over the paint to make sure that the paint's waterproof and does not get into the water. And I got a fish heater in here. As you can see, the cord is right here. But I put a rock over it just to make it look more natural. And the water tank uh, stays in here at about 80 degrees Fahrenheit. And I have one opaline Gawarmia in here. Seems to like it. I know the water is relatively shallow, but this is 36 inches long. So it gives him a lot of space to swim because fish usually don't swim up and down. They more like to swim from one side to the other. So um, yeah, that's basically it. And just got gravel and rocks were purchased at Dollarama. As long with these uh, LED lights were also purchased at Dollarama. So when it gets dark out, then we'll give the fish some extra light. Give the one plant some good light. And that's pretty much it. So that's a homemade fish fountain. Hope you guys enjoy.